Good afternoon, oil traders. It is Tuesday, September 26th at 3.19 p.m. Eastern Time, and uh, we still got, well, just about 40 minutes or so left in uh, trading here on the East Coast of North America, and um, I think for the most part we're done. Um, it looks like basically traders have decided to settle somewhere about the middle of the range of the day, um, which is just below $52 on the price of crude. <clears throat> and um, Yet again, we hit a low that was somewhat already attractive to me, um, 51.44. Um, I probably would have taken a small profit on that uh, short that I bought yesterday um, at a crude price of 51.87. Um, but as is always the case apparently in my world, in my life, um, we never settled there. Um, one of my rules is that I look for the price to settle for a good you know, 15 minutes at least or so. Um, at whatever range it chooses uh, before I put in an order and uh, as you can see we touch those lows and then climb right back up towards 52 and that's kind of where we're ending the day so never really got my opportunity to enter any sell order um, and you know maybe that's for the best if tomorrow we end up at 51 or, or lower um, but it is you know, somewhat frustrating to see the opportunity to sell and not having had the actual opportunity to execute anything on it. Um, like I said this morning, uh, it looks like traders are anticipating news, um, which we've got tonight at 4.30 from API, and tomorrow we've got news um, from EIA, um, inventory on crude and gasoline, etc. at 10.30 a.m. Eastern Time. You know, and regardless of what direction we go based on API, um, we may or may not go in the same direction um, with a EIA news tomorrow. And uh, not only about direction, but magnitude. I mean, past two weeks we've had relatively bearish news, um, but we just kept on going up anyway. So go figure. Um, what that means for bearish or bullish news this week, your guess is as good as mine. Um, basically, I'm just going to stick to my targets, try to stick to my rules. Uh, you know, today I certainly was tempted to take a small profit um, right at the open and at least reposition my short um, a little bit better. And, you know, in hindsight, I could have done that. Um, ultimately, I decided to kind of stick with my trading rules and uh, it didn't quite work out for me today. But it's not like I lost out on a big profit either. Um, hopefully, I get rewarded soon. But uh, let me know how you guys are doing. Hit me up down below on the comments on YouTube or over on uh, tradingjournal.ca where you can find more information on my portfolio, trades, charts, etc., etc. Um, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to stay tuned, and I'll check back with you guys ahead of trading tomorrow and after we know what it is that API has to say at uh, or before 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Till then, good luck. Cheers.